Hello, I'm Bob, and today I want to introduce you to the Kobe Wireless TV Speaker, a portable TV listening assistance device for the hard of hearing. This amazing device uses voice highlighting, which allows dialogue and sound effects to come through crystal clear. In the box is the wireless TV speaker, a charging base, a wall adapter micro USB charger, an optical cable, auxiliary cable, and a micro USB charging cable and the user manual. On the front of the speaker are the indicator lights. On the top is the mute and mode button. On the side is the volume and on-off dial. On the back is the charging port, earbuds or headphones jack, which I will demonstrate later, and an auxiliary or line-in port. And on the bottom is the connection for the charging dock. On the front of the dock is the optical and line-in indicators. On the back is the power connection, 3.5 millimeter connection, optical connection, mode or standby button, and pairing reset. Please charge your speaker first by connecting the charging base to an outlet using the micro USB charger and placing the speaker on the dock. If you want to hide the docking station, or if it isn't convenient, to make charging easy, plug the included micro USB cable into a charger and charge wherever an outlet is available, like I'm doing on my bedside table. When charging, the battery indicator will flash. Next, connect your TV speaker. If your TV uses an optical output, use the optical cable included. Remove the protective caps from both ends first and connect one end to your TV and the other end to the optical port on the charging station. Or you can connect using the 3.5 millimeter cable from the TV output to the line-in port on the charging station. If your TV has RCA connections only, you will need a 3.5 millimeter to RCA adapter. To use, Turn the power or volume knob clockwise to power on the speaker. Set the volume and press the mode button until TV is lit. If you are transmitting from your dock to the TV speaker, even if you are using the auxiliary port to connect the TV to the dock, always be on TV. Now press the mode standby button on the dock to toggle between auxiliary and optical to choose your connection. It will display on the front of the dock. On your TV, set the sound from TV speaker output to optical if using the optical cable, or if using the 3.5 millimeter cable, you might need to change the TV output to auxiliary if you don't hear any sound. In addition, different TVs have different settings to switch the format from Dolby to PCM. If you are having difficulties, please refer to your TV manual, look it up online, or on YouTube for visual illustration. Like now Curry use the volume the control of your TV audio speaker, and speaker and for hard of hearing to adjust to your liking. You can also plug in some headphones to listen without disturbing your partner. The sound, Press the mute button at point. any time to mute the sound. The speaker can be taken into the next room up to 100 feet and still have crystal clear sound. So don't turn up the volume on your TV because you can't hear or move closer to the TV, which can cause eye strain. Get the Kobe Wireless TV speaker today and bring the sound right to you.